Hi all. Today we are going to talk about 3D modeling for VFX. 3D modeling is a part of asset department. But what does asset department includes? Asset department includes five streams along with 3D modeling, texturing, loop tape, groom and rigging. Before we discuss more about 3D modeling, I would like to introduce myself first. My name is Vijay. I am a 3D modeling academy trainer here at Technicolor Creative Studios. With more than 10 years of production experience, I have been a part of VFX industry from past 5 years. I have worked on projects like Dark Phoenix, Pokemon Detective Pikachu, Focus Focus 2, Vikings and many more. Let us start with some simple questions. Based on the project, the modeling department receives input in the form of reference image, concept art and 3D scan data based on which they create 3D models such as digitables, creatures, concept characters, environment, props and vehicles. After completing the 3D models, the models will be published to upper streams for the respective works. Creative skills and observation skills like understanding the shape and the form of the objects are essential. When it comes for organic modeling, one should know more about anatomy of the character. Another set of very useful skill set for 3D modeling is drawing and sketching skills, as well as problem solving skills to achieve the best result. Technical skills For as technical skills, software knowledge like Autodesk Maya and ZBrush are vital. Both are equally important. Organic modeling usually creates 3D model of living creatures such as human or animal. Art surface modeling is usually focused on objects or non-living entities. Although different techniques are used between organic and inorganic model, both are equally important. Spend more time on practicing and try with different types of organic and art surface models. Working with correct tools and techniques not only makes easy to model, but it also saves time. Getting feedback from trainers is also really important to improve one's modeling standards. We use three types of softwares in production when it comes for 3D modeling. Autodesk Maya, ZBrush and Speedtrick. Autodesk Maya is mainly used to build a model like organic characters and art surface like vehicles and buildings. ZBrush is used for sculpting concept art, animal sculpt and creatures. And finally speed tree is used to create a trees and vegetation in 3D environment. Creatively, 3D models should match the reference image as closely as possible. Technically, applying with a good shader like plane and show the wireframe on the poly. Present the model along with the reference image side by side and 360 degree turntable. These things can be followed for all types of the model. The academy will connect with your trainers such as myself. You will be trained for 9 weeks, spending the whole duration sharpening your skills and gaining a valuable knowledge about the production pipeline. Trainers with the production experience will teach, guide and push you to improve your creative and technical skills to industry standards by assigning the tasks and projects. And as an added bonus, you get paid while being trained. Thank you all. I hope this was informative on 3D modeling and helps you to build a career as a 3D modeler. Happy modeling!